Uh, my name is Leah Skinner, and I am the executive director for the Laverne Chamber of Commerce. Primarily, the chamber provides support and services for a specific community. In Laverne, it's a geographical community. There's also chambers that are based around heritage and nationality. There's um, regional chambers, state chambers. There's a world chamber of commerce. So, uh, but specifically it's, it's around a specific demographic that provides support and services for the businesses in that specific segment. We are not a government agency. We are not in any way affiliated with the government. We are our own separate tax exempt nonprofit organization. So we're a membership organization. Our members are the businesses. They do pay a membership investment every year. Um, and we are tax exempt, but we are not a charitable organization. So we're not a 501c3. So your membership investment does not count as a charitable um, donation for a tax deduction, but it can be written off as a necessary business expense. So there are benefits of membership. Um, and I, I will say it, it kind of varies from business to business. Every business gets something different out of their chamber membership um, based on what their needs are. Some of the main overreaching benefits would be we provide information. So, uh, you know, we keep our businesses informed on legislation, funding opportunities, uh, changes in labor laws, community happenings, city happenings. So we, we keep the information. We are that funnel for everything goes through us directly through them. So they're not looking at a million different places to get the information that they need to stay in business. Um, we help to provide connections. So, uh, and, and that can go all over the place. I mean, from finding potential clients to vendors and resources or, uh, you know, just a shoulder to cry on when you've had a tough day because somebody else is going through it too. Um, and, and we provide that sense of community as well. So um, we, members of the Laverne Chamber of Commerce are very involved in the community of the city of Laverne. And the business community is, is a community in and of itself. Um, like I said, that, that shoulder to cry on. When you're an entrepreneur and you're a you know sole owner operator of your business you really do kind of get lost in your own world sometimes so by belonging to the chamber it, it broadens your horizons and it brings you in contact with other people that are going through all the same situations that you're going through you know i was going to say traditional benefits of membership we're always known for our networking events we do do that we do provide opportunities we go to a place and time and everybody comes out and and you know, is able to have those one-on-one -on -one conversations and get to know everybody. Um, we provide referrals and marketing opportunities. I, every day we get a phone call from somebody somewhere that's looking for something. So, you know, from plumbers and real estate agents to, you know, birthday party venues and florists and, and, and you name it. Um, they call the chamber looking. We are considered a reliable resource, so they trust the businesses that are a member of the chamber. So when we provide a, a referral, they feel secure that they're not going to get a dishonest business. We do so many different things. <laughs> we help with exporting. We <laughs> we do a lot of things. Chambers are, are very big in scope of work. The one thing I would say, and it, even if you haven't joined the chamber yet, um, it's almost more important. Call us for anything and everything. Even if you don't think that it is part of the scope of our work, we have those, you know, resources and referrals. I can always say, I know a guy, right? You know, if, if you're looking for funding for expansioning, I, we partner with the SBDC. I always reach out and, and um, if you're dealing with permit process with some of the different government agencies and you're getting a little lagged down, I reach out to our local elected officials and ask for help. Um, if you're running into landlord tenant problems, we know attorneys, again, another opportunity to refer to the SPDC because I know you guys do so much and you're such a great partner. 
uh, but there's really no element too small or out of the ordinary that we can't help you find a resource or an answer for. So I would say that is the biggest tip. And, and when you get all of those administrative tasks under control, all your operational tasks under control, uh, we get those problems solved for you and your day to day is running smooth, then you have more opportunity to do what you need to do to market and grow or expand your business. Uh, but there's a perceived credibility for a business that you know has that chamber logo on their website or their marketing materials consumers automatically assume that that business is more stable more reliable and more trustworthy because they have made the investment to join their local chamber and support their local community in that way so that in and of itself is a great marketing tool for you uh, we do all sorts of different ways to help get our businesses seen in our local community we're always promoting the idea of shopping local, keep your dollars in town, um, and the benefits of that for the overall community. So that's uh, that's always been very successful. And um, at, we recently did our first online Best of Laverne voting. <laughs> we had a huge turnout. Uh, it was fantastic for the first year. We're really excited about it. Um, but again, that was another opportunity where people were seeing these businesses and maybe for the first time and taking that opportunity to go out and explore the community better and, oh, wow, I just found a new plumber because everybody in Laverne voted they were the best plumber in Laverne or, you know, now I know where I'm going for tacos on Tuesday or so it, we do different programs specifically to help market the, the businesses as well. But just the simple use of having the logo does a lot in and of itself and it's very passive not a lot of work and effort on the business owner's part. Most chambers uh, will, you know, literally have a website that's like ours, lavernechamber.org, more common than .com. So as again, we are nonprofit. A lot of city website, their local city will have a link to the chamber website on theirs as well. I know the city of Laverne does uh, for us here. So we're pretty easy to find the number is 3,500 chambers of commerce in the United States. And there's over 270 in the state of California alone. So a lot of chambers do have a physical storefront and regular business hours. Some chambers are all volunteer run. And so they might have more of a virtual office and the website or telephone is gonna be their main areas to connect. So, um, and that's traditionally in you know smaller rural populations where you'll find those types of chambers. But again, they still have them. Traditionally, when you join the chamber, it's actually after that you have established your business, you've gotten all your permits and, and all that great stuff. And that is the right time to join, really, is once you're up and running. But the chamber is still an amazing resource to help you get to that point. So it's a good thing. Once you think about starting a business, visit your local chamber, talk to them. They will provide resources for you that you would take you months on your own to accumulate. So um, it, it's really such a great step. Things that you've never thought about, like what are some questions you should ask before you sign the lease? Uh, you know, did you know that it's really important to make sure that you have cell phone coverage in that property you're about to sign? Did you even think about that? So just some really critical business information before you really dive deep into it. Are you picking a place that's zoned properly for you if you're opening a brick and mortar? Are you picking a place that's zoned properly for a home-based business? So just so many questions and concerns that you can find all the answers to in one place. And then come back and go to Chamber once you open. <laughs> we'll keep your doors open. We'll help you keep your doors open.